All right, this one I jumped to. Uh, okay, fuck it. This next one, it's easy. Don't worry about it. This next one is also the same thing. It has the trajectory on it. It has two parallel lines that are obviously are what I consider to be the trajectories that control the obviously the angle and direction of entry. But this one is the slightly different. It's not carved in, but built into the meteorite or what I consider to be spacecraft. You don't have to worry about that too much. I'll just get not even, okay, you understood. It is a big fucking deal, but don't worry about it. I got you. Like, okay, this one right here, it's brown, obviously. Okay, I'll show you. Don't worry about it. <laughs> it's easy. I look like this. Obviously, you already seen it. You got a little uh, sneak peek before I could move it. But this right here is what it looks like. Obviously, the crafter looks like this. It has a somewhat of an elongated skull, and the head cuts back like that. And this one right here itself is not only a meteorite, that it, obviously, that they use as far as meteorite study, but also with something that was fit for the human hand. This part right here is a uh, cut. So that it turns into a, almost like somewhat like a blade so that when you hold it, you hold it like this. Every one of these meteorites are cut to be uh, not only, like I said, uh, used for meteorite study, but also for the human hand. Because once it hits Earth, they can't recover it. So they want to say, yeah, basically, if a human comes along and picks it up, they might use it as a hand tool. Again, remember that these, these uh, meteorites are ancient. So you don't have to worry about uh, don't worry about that shit. Don't worry. Yeah, basically, I, I got you. Don't worry about it. But yeah, these meteorites are ancient. Obviously, they were meant for the uh, basically the ancients, man, a long time ago. And something you ain't got to really worry about. But this is what it looks like. I'll show you the meteorite itself. And basically, like that. You can see the lines right here. You can't really see it, I guess, with the camera quality or whatever. But there's actually two parallel lines, and they're tightly packed. And you can see that it goes all the way around. You can see this one's a little, little dim right there, but it's still there. And it goes all the way around. You can see that. that. That right there, obviously, you can see it very brightly. But it's two parallel lines, two of them. And uh, if I hold it like this, you can see. Well, I'm not sure if you can see the eye, but it's slightly carved into it. So you can get the idea. And obviously, it's a cut right here so that you can use it as a hand tool. Every one of these are cut to be hand tools, and they fit the human hand perfectly. If you notice like that, it has an edge right there. You can see it right there. You just hold it like that perfectly, and you can use it as a hand tool. There's a lot of these. They range from that massive one I showed you first to these small ones. There are even some smaller ones, but they use all kinds of these. I'm making a few of these videos, but I have hundreds. You basically, okay, you have, okay, good, you're good, don't worry about it. I got you, but this is just one of them, big ass fucking hair. And I got these, <laughs> this is just one, this is one of the, obviously, I got it, okay, good, you worry about it, you're good. All right, cool. I'll just keep rolling and I keep showing you this video. Yeah, you can see the eye right there. That's what it is. But I'll keep, I'll keep rolling and I'll keep showing you more of these uh, alien self portraits. Man, it's easy, man. That's it. Ah, uh, cool, good. Don't worry about it. I got this shit unlocked. All right, I'll do this thing. You ain't got to worry about it. It's easy.